Today, everybody is talking about disruptive technologies. The public has a wrong image that any two kids with a laptop can easily disrupt a billion dollar industry overnight. But here at MVP Workshop, we know it's far from the truth because we've actually done it. Disruption is often misunderstood as a negative term, one that can be associated with some kind of threat. But that's not the case here. Disrupting an industry and creating a new market value is about innovating and making a change for the better. We are fixated on creating something new using the latest technologies and tools like blockchain. And we want to invite you to disrupt together with us. So how did we end up in a blockchain industry? Basically, we tried to tackle the email problem. So one of the most frighteningly ambitious startup ideas is basically an email. What we wanted to do is to disrupt an email industry by having the most secure and private email in the world. And for that, we used the blockchain, namely Ethereum, yes, because back then it was uh, so cool to do that. So, uh, no, it wasn't. <laughs> It was 2015, 16, so it wasn't that cool. But nonetheless, we tried because it was general purpose blockchain. We did that. It's known uh, as a lemon email. After that, we do mainly two things. Uh, the first one is we do our projects, like uh, Scriptarnica is, for example, uh, decentralization, tokenization for the books. The second thing we do is basically we do that for uh, other projects also known as clients. We collaborate on other st interesting stuff like Celsius. This is how we get there. As a team, we have over 15 years of experience in delivering tech products, and we got into the blockchain game relatively early. So this is our unique advantage. Uh, we can provide both business model validation and development under one roof. And I think that people from this industry know that this is not uh, something you can find easily. In most businesses that we work with, uh, we have two very important unknowns the validity of the new business model itself and the return on investment of using an unproven disruptive technology such as blockchain. Uh, this is true both for startups and established companies. Recently, we helped our client Celsius Network define and build their product and execute a $50 million ICO. Uh, building trust in both tech and business component of this project was crucial both for our client and their investors. Uh, and it is the same with large corporations that have tremendous reach and resources but need to be 100% sure before they can put a product in front of their customers. The most critical factor for startup success is not the money or the idea or even a great team. It's timing. This is significant insight based on the analysis of hundreds of startups who succeeded or failed. And with the blockchain-based startups, timing is even more of importance. Timing can make or break your next idea. So if you value your time as much as we do, let's talk.